I first became aware of climate change at the same time a lot of Americans did, when Hurricane Katrina was bearing down on New Orleans, which was my home at the time. I had no idea what kind of devastation we could be facing until I saw it with my own eyes. I'm Gabe Vishniewski, I'm the director of energy campaigns for Greenpeace in the U.S. Climate change will touch every single life on this planet. The scientific community really speaks with one voice on this subject. We are pushing our planet dangerously close to tipping points. Right now we're addicted to old 19th and 20th century forms of energy. We need to replace those energy sources with renewables like wind and solar. The question is whether we can summon the courage to pursue those solutions at the rate and scale that we need to to make a difference for the climate. At Greenpeace we think the answer is yes. In poll after poll we see Americans want renewable energy to happen. We're also finally starting to see corporations wise up. Big companies like Google and Apple are making commitments to power their operations with 100% renewable energy like wind and solar, and the market is really starting to respond. We are pushing utility companies like Duke Energy to invest more of their money in renewable energy and take it out of old energy sources like coal, nukes, and gas. Of course, the coal industry isn't going to take this line down. As they see Americans turn away from fossil fuels, they're looking for new places to sell their product. They're taking American taxpayer-owned coal from places like Wyoming and Montana, and they're trying to ship it to new markets in Asia. Greenpeace is pushing these companies to leave that coal in the ground. I started working for Greenpeace a year after the storm hit New Orleans because I was mad. I wanted to work for an organization that wasn't afraid to challenge corporations, challenge government, and speak the truth about what was happening. There are not a lot of groups out there who are willing to stand up and look bad guys in the eye and say, we're going to stand in your way and we're going to block you every step of the way. The destruction you're causing is not going to happen on our watch.